Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today, let me share with you my after sun care routine to calm heated skin fast and how to bring back skin's condition after a long day out in the sun. Let's get started. For days like this, it's important to double cleanse. I'm going to be using Oxygen Suticles Gentle Facial Cleansing Lotion as our first cleanser. Since we have applied and hopefully reapplied a lot of sunscreen throughout the day, it's important to make sure you thoroughly cleanse everything off. Especially after a long day, out in the sun, your skin is most likely super sensitized and irritated at the moment. So using a soft, creamy cleansing lotion like this will help to get rid of everything very gently yet effectively. Massage everything in with your hands and then just simply rinse off with water. For the second cleanser, I'm going to be using Skin and Lab High Barrier Hyaluronic Capsule Cleanser. This is quietly new to the game, but I've been using it every single day for my face and my body. First of all, it's humongous. I love the size. You can use it for the face, the body, whatever you need. And the price point is just excellent and it's so hydrating. It contains capsules with hyaluronic acid, so it cleanses without any tightness and dryness. Especially for sun exposed skin, you want to use something as gentle and hydrating as this cleanser. And I want to highly recommend just using your hands to wash your body and your face because using any type of like body scrub towels or shower balls or using any type of cleansing devices on face, this can all inflame the skin, causing redness, itchiness, or even a rash because your skin is so, you know, sensitized after being exposed for a long day out in the sun. Now that we're done with cleansing, let's really focus on relieving our skin after a long day. This is my go-to toner when my skin is mad at me these days. This skin balancing toner is from Oxygenceuticals. It has a very fresh, watery, light texture without any type of tacky nor sticky feeling. And you do want to look for toners that regulate sebum and moisture balance really well after your skin has been exposed to sun for a long time. This is really crucial because even when your skin is slightly heated, it can lead to excessive sebum and so many different skin concerns. So you want to make sure that you calm the heat of your skin as soon as possible. And you do want to use something that can balance out the sebum and moisture balance. So that's why for the next step, I want to highly recommend using a sheet mask. I'm using Rovectin Doctor Mask Sika today. This is a restoring mask for damaged skin. The material of the sheet is also very important when choosing a sheet mask for after sun care. You want to make sure that it's soft, it's like cushiony, that it will not irritate your skin that has been already sensitized, you know, by the sun. So keep that in mind that the material really matters. And using a sheet mask is such an easy, simple way to calm heated skin rapidly and definitely depending on the active ingredients in the sheet mask that you're using it can really bring back your skin's condition very fast and i'm gonna be adding in a cooler on top of my sheet mask just to make sure to maximize the whole process and speed things up a little bit. Now for the serum step, we will be using a new arrival from Robectin. This is the Sika Care Clearing Ample, which is formulated with 73% of high concentration of Sika. This is from the same line as a sheet mask. I've been obsessed with this ample because it has everything that I was looking for, for a ample in the summertime. With almost a very gunky, viscous, thick gel-like texture that that definitely has a body when you first squeeze it out everything starts quickly melting down into your skin and it turns into this light refreshing texture when you soak it in the main ingredients for both the ample and the sheet mask is calamine known as the magic pink powder which is an irritation relief ingredient to calm redness caused by bumps breakouts which makes it a great hormonal acne product as well i also have acne prone skin and um, i have I dealt with adult acne most of my life and this product has really worked well for me especially if you do have hormonal acne or different types of breakouts this is amazing and both products also have madecasoside which is a plant-based antioxidant that revitalizes sensitive skin and helps with scar repair and dark 
spot treatment. Oh, and also the new Ample has a patent formula called Made White that's developed with Madikasocyte from Madagascar to reduce melanin production and inflammatory pigmentation. So all in all, this sheet mask and the Ample is perfect to use for after sun care. Now we're going to finish off the routine with a cream that will help to make sure to lock in all the moisture that has been lost and that will help to calm your skin down fast. I'm using its Skin Power 10 Formula LI Cream. I've introduced this cream on my Instagram only, but I thought this is a perfect cream to add into your aftercare routine because this cream has guayazuline. Yes, I'm actually dancing to this while I'm saying the ingredient, guayazuline, which is also in Claire's Midnight Blue Calming Cream. This beautiful like bluish color ingredient is from chamomile flower, and this ingredient is amazing for sensitized, irritated skin. This cream has a non-sticky texture, but it's definitely more on the heavier side for the summertime, but it feels really nice and cushiony, especially when my skin is irritated. Also from the same line, they have a really good toner pad and a serum. If you guys are interested, I'll make sure to leave all the details in the description. So please do check it out. All right, guys, hope you guys enjoyed. Remember after sun care is time sensitive. So always remember the sooner the better. And also I have a video for after sun care for the hair, for the scalp and the body as well. So please stay tuned in and see you in the next one. Bye.